This question asks us to show that the photosynthesis of sugar is a redox reaction. And we have the unbalanced reaction shown up here. Okay, to balance this reaction, we take uh, six carbon dioxides and react it with six waters, produce one sugar molecule and six oxygens. Now, this is a non-spontaneous reaction. Energy comes in in the form of light. And to show that this is a redox reaction, what we need to do is we need to assign oxidation numbers. Now recall, in compounds, oxygen typically has oxidation numbers of minus 2. So I'm writing the oxidation numbers here. In its elemental form, oxygen is has an oxidation number of 0. Okay. Now for hydrogen in compounds, typically has oxidation numbers of plus one. So plus one here, and a plus one here. Well, carbon is a very variable oxidation number, and so I assigned the oxidation numbers of oxygen and hydrogen first before I worked on carbon. Okay, and so for carbon, we would have to have an oxidation number of plus four here, because plus four plus 2 times negative 2 has to be equal to the s charge of the species, which is 0. Okay? Here, for that to hold, to have 6 carbons and its oxi their oxidation numbers added to the oxidation numbers of all the hydrogens and all the oxygens, the carbon's oxidation number here has to be equal to 0. Okay? And so what we have then is carbon is decreasing in oxidation number going from carbon dioxide to sugar and so this is a reduction and here the oxygen increases in oxidation number as it goes from water to oxygen gas and so this is an oxidation okay and as I mentioned earlier, this is a non-spontaneous reaction, non-spontaneous redox reaction, which takes place when plants do photosynthesis. Now, the reverse reaction is shown here in this little uh, biofuel cell, okay, where we have sugars and other biomass being combined with air with the assistance of bacteria to produce carbon dioxide and water and we're producing energy to make the little LED blink on that unit. And so I want to point out that the reverse reaction is a redox reaction, but it is a spontaneous redox reaction. Because energy is being produced. 